focus on me. Hey guys, well, wait, no, that's not our intro. That is not our intro. What of the L Squad, and you're watching the L Sisters. <laughs> Today, 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 as you can see by the title of this video, right? Let me just pull my bra. As you can tell by the title of today's video, I'm going to be installing and customizing and installing my very first wig. I'm now transitioning from braids and all of that to wigs, okay? Right. Girly. So, instead of paying freaking £50 to get a freaking hair install, why don't I want to learn it myself? Why shouldn't I learn it myself? Okay, right. So I'm gonna do my first ever wig install today. So the hair I'm gonna be using is Osili hair. Guys, listen. It's Wednesday and it's 12.45. No school today, just at home. And listen, it sounds a bit chaotic outside. I can't even, I don't even know if you guys can hear. Today I'm gonna be using Osili hair from AliExpress. This video is not sponsored by the way. Bought this hair with my own money. And yeah, it's a 4x4 four four closure wig. 24 inches. And inside the bag, it comes, it comes with like this new cute bag. Protects your hair. Comes with a pair of lashes. And a wig cap. Two wig caps. And then, this is the hair. This is the hair, it's 24 inches. It feels so good. This is new, girl. This is new. 4x4 four four closure. Guys, you have to educate yourself on this, on wigs. There's a difference between closure and frontal. I still don't know. I don't think I'm gonna really ever gonna know. All I know is like a frontal is like the whole like front and then the closure is just, you can get 13 by six and then four by four and it's just like, this is low maintenance a bit more customization is going to include bleaching the knots plucking plucking whatever the video i'm gonna be watching tells me so it's just a middle part basically i think i'll put a link to the hair in the description box down below so we're gonna start with bleaching the um knots first so okay i have a fear of um dolls and stuff like that so this is mannequin head right i'm kind of like pulling myself for it right now like i think having this i don't even know or whatever that i found and i'm just gonna be holding the mannequin like that makes me feel more like i can't touch it like it's actually bad let me put it inside out because i'll be bleaching the hair of course so let me put it inside out I'm gonna be using this bleach. Um, yeah, these are bleaches you can find in your hair shop, I think, but my mom just had it. So. Safety first, safety first.
how much it is but i'm gonna be checking mine every 10 minutes make sure that you know everything's going all right you don't want to over bleach it like she said so i'm gonna try not to do so yeah we're gonna leave that there so what time is it now it is it's one o'clock exactly and i'm gonna be back at 10 past to check if it's bleached so i'm in the bathroom and i can't I'm in the bathroom now and I'm going to wash it out with some purple shampoo. I just got this from Savers. This is the L'Oreal Paris purple shampoo. So I'm going to wash it out. I washed it with purple shampoo like I showed you and now it's time to do the plucking some uh, person I watch like to pluck it dry wet sorry so I'm gonna pluck it wet too but it's a little bit too wet for me so I think I might blow dry it So I've just got these tw this tweezer set from Amazon too. I'm just gonna use this one. So I've plucked the hair to what I think is good, right? So okay. And then I'm gonna re um re walk, straighten it because obviously it's been blow dried and everything.
guys it's been like an hour or something since i, I just took a break from um uh, yeah i just took a break so it's now 3 48 and i'm back okay so i'm gonna record right and then i'm gonna show you how it looks this is how it looks i'm just gonna pluck one of this this side again but yeah this is how it looks and i'm gonna re-straighten the hair re-straighten the hair This is as plucked and thing is gonna get. Let's come. Guys, I don't have a tripod for this. I'm just gonna use a broom. Like that. Got the hair here. I mean, how do people strain hair anyways? basically finished straight the wig's basically done the hair is straightened the um knots are bleached that's basically the wig done right now i'm just gonna cut the ledge the edges and i'm gonna install this wig another day on a saturday today's wednesday and like i want to like go to school like in the, in the new week not in the middle of the week like we'll start on my last week of secondary school so i'm just gonna do that <sighs> I'm gonna use this and I'm just gonna trim it. So I'm just brush these back. And that is the wig custom made station complete and i'll see you guys on saturday for when i just install it on my head top so guys it's like the weekend now it's sunday today and yeah it's hair installation day so i'm gonna install it on my head top so you guys can see that um, i got my mother to braid my hair so i just braid it into the corner So it came with some wig caps, so I didn't have to like go to the shop and buy some wig caps. I'm just gonna use it, and I'm not gonna. I'm gonna be using got to be blue. If I if it had like that, it's like that. Like that. So we can put this on our head now. Yeah. 
know this is gonna be so weird. As in people actually put wigs on their head top. It's meant to be just tight first of all. This is why frontals will always be better. Just look at this. I don't like it. It's so tight on my head top that I can't even think right. Do you see this? Like, I don't like that. Okay. Oh, I know what I can do. I can do edges there. I think I can do that. When I had less than a tank of it, it's Okay, so, I'm gonna take this thing off my hair real quick because first of all, my hair is hurting. I think next time, so I'll get my four by four. Um, I'll get a what's it called? A bigger, if it's not a frontal, then I'll get a bigger closure like unit, you know, like six by six or something. I'm just gonna spray this as well. So. Now I know why they put makeup. Guys, I don't know if it's the wig or if it's a wig cap or what it is, but it just hurts my head so freaking much. So you know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna just install this for this video because I just can't. It hurts. I don't know if you're just looking worse on my head or what, but it hurts. Okay. Now she's got her brush, and the brush is lit. The thing is on everything. So you guys got the gist of it and because um, the space is running out i'll see you guys when i'm finished 
straightening my hair and hot combing and all of that. Slap period. So guys, mind the background noise. Uh, renovation happening currently in the house. Uh, it is very loud. But yeah, this is my hair straightened. This is straightened. Insecurities I had before have literally escaped because now I look the good. So, guys, this is the final look. I'm just gonna keep this headband thing on because. Um, Late, that's another story and we're gonna perfect that another day but everything else looks good like the hair looks good like do you see that but I don't, I don't like closures so next time we get in frog baby we're gonna front from okay we're gonna slay like arrogant tay and that's on what period i hope you guys enjoyed this little video hope, don't forget to comment down below thumbs up subscribe to the channel you know all of them things there and yeah I'll see you guys in our next youtube video but all our social medias you know you know you know the drill you know the you know girl finished year 11 secondary school she got a three month break so you know Content gonna be there, you know. No incognito until six form, yeah. Because there's no reason for me to be incognito when I've got three months off. You know what I'm saying? Come on, saying yeah, yeah, yeah. You get, you get the gist, right? Yeah. See you guys in our next YouTube video. Bye, guys. Peace.